worm poops now. Because, I don't know, this is nice thematically. I don't have a name. settings. TV listings. Let's configure our thing. Also see my chat. It's very important. It's very important to be able to see your chat. Begin a stream. See if this is a good chance later. What's an actual thing? Yeah, so I always have subtitles on. Don't know why I would want it above 100%. So why not? Vox Populi feature allows you to see what decisions other players have made at various points in the game. The rescue request function allows other players to help you when you're in a pimps, and you to help others in return. Don't know if I have enough friends for that to be functional, but I will leave it. These features are not available at the very beginning of the game. They will be unlocked as the story progresses. Cool, cool. Okay. 
That's not a fact of the story, so choose one that we'll be comfortable with. This part is easier than easy. I said hope so. Relax and enjoy the story. The bar is wiped and better. You can instantly retry. There's your last confidence. The little moped guy gets bigger and bigger down. Now that's how the experience of ours are easier than normal mode, so don't get too worked up. Normal. This is the best balance of difficulty and enjoyment. Please experience the tension. Art. This is for the confident. Battles are more challenging. And you experience severe gameplay. Do you hate yourself? Or are you supremely self-confident? This difficulty requires the strength of parts that never gives in. I always do normal. Because it's literally called normal. So I assume that's what the game was originally designed at. Cool. Yes. <laughs> Goodbye, moped. I really have fun with the game. Never did finish Persona 3. I did try, though. Yes, I do. But there was, like, a lot of grinding. So I'm starting to wonder if, like, this might be better as, like, an edited playthrough than a live thing. But an edited thing would require me to, like, edit my streams. I'm not sure what I want to do. I don't have time. Or care. To try. Cool, cool. It's a car. Certainly a voice this isn't the maid. So we're just gonna start off. Did we start off from the Velvet Room in 3? Ah, it seems we have a guest with an intriguing destiny. <laughs> My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. Are your eyes okay? This you place like wanna, exists like, between dream ball. and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. It may be that such a fate awaits you in the near future. Now then, why don't you introduce yourself? My name is Dave. I do Dave things. Oh. Until your last name. Hmm. I, mean, I guess I could look up the default name, but why have that be my style? I mean, I have so many manga on my soul, so I just take someone's last name. Well, let's see here. Got Dodgy Manga Style, Sailor V, Ghost Do I do Arakara? I kind of want to do Arakara. I think I need to figure out a first name. Yep, we're gonna go with Bomer Alchemist Author. First name. This song never changes. Alright, first name. Now that one's gonna be more difficult. Let's see, on Persona 3, I went with the Dismon protagonist, but. The fourth season of Digimon was not amazing. Actually, no, I'm going back on that because then I'd have to pronounce it. Let's avoid ours. Alright, damn.
start with Nietzsche Jar then. Nietzsche Jar is author. Hmm. E I I. K Chi. K T R K A R K A R K C. Yep. That seems that seems unbrand enough for me. Let's go with it. Hmm. I see. Now let's take a look into your future. You're shall never we? gonna actually use my actual name, are you, game? After all that effort I put into Do it. Do you believe in fortune telling? No. No, I don't. Each reading is done with the same cards, yet the result is always different. What? <laughs> Life itself follows the same principles, doesn't it? What? Sounds like you just don't have a full deck. Hmm. The tower in the upright position represents the immediate future. It seems a terrible catastrophe is imminent. The Why, card there, indicating the future grass? beyond that is... Samu, Samu. The moon in the upright position. This card represents hesitation and mystery. Very interesting indeed. It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination. And a great mystery will be imposed upon you. Cool. In the coming days, you will enter into a contract of some sort, after which you will return here. The coming year is a turning point in your destiny. If the mystery goes unsolved, your future may be forever lost. Are you, are you saying I'm going to die or just is to provide what? assistance to our guests to ensure that does not happen. What kind of sentence is your future will be lost? Ah, I thought you saying I'm going to die or that you're not actually going to introduce my assistant to you. Wait, you only flipped two Martin. cards. She is a resident of this place, like myself. Yes, My I... name is Margaret. I am here to accompany you through your journey. Yeah, I'll look up that voice later. We maybe. shall attend to the details another time. Until then, farewell. And just tosses me out the car. Um, that's a transition they chose to do to me. Magic? Why is there sort of named Magic? With the refreshing taste of calorie magic. And we're back. Now on to some juicy news. The Mayumi Yamano scandal. I'm sure everyone is <laughs> yeah, first he bags a singer, then he has an affair with a TV announcer on the side. Do chicks really dig politicians? Isn't it just I mean, stuff like power. money and connections? When you get down to it, financial and political clout is what matters. Hey, oh, hey, Wendy Lee. How are you doing today? To well, what do you think? I'm a cool guy, doing cool guy things like staying on the subway. Well, I'm sure that you all know already, but at the end of this month, he will be transferring to another school. What a tragedy! Down, guys. I'm not done yet. Winder makes me so sad. Thank goodness I have you, phone. We will arrive at the Yasugami terminal in a few minutes. Passengers headed for Inaba City and Yaso Inaba Station. Please go to the other side of the platform. <clears throat> the scandal involves the Enka star Misuzu Hiragi preparing to tour overseas. Taro Namatame, a council secretary in the Inaba region, whom she married just last year, is now under suspicion of having an affair. What's more, his rumored mistress is the well-known TV oh, announcer. Ms. Should Mayumi we go Yama. soon? Yes, just about. The question on everyone's minds is how this love triangle will affect. I... 
Yeah, that's what I get for falling on asleep on a train. Yaso Inaba. Yaso Inaba. The announcer sounds confused by that. Yaso Inaba. Who actually wants to go to Yaso Inaba? I'm less detailed now. Hey, over here. What? I'm not going to have to voice anyone in this game, am I? Well, you're more handsome in person than in your photo. Welcome to Inaba. I'm Ryotaro Dojima. I'll be looking after you. Let's see, I'm your mother's younger brother, and that about sums it up. Hmm. This is going to decide the fate of the entire game. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to go for double ellipses, but... Uh, let's just go with Oblivious. I have no idea who this guy is. Huh. You probably don't remember, but we've met. I've changed your diapers before, you know? This here's my daughter. Come on, Nanako. Introduce yourself to your cousin. <laughs> Hello. Ah, her eyes glowed. What? <laughs> What are you so shy for? He knows I'm possessed. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> well then, let's get going. My car is over there. Uh, hello. Hey. Significant looking character. You dropped this. Whatever. All I did was pick it up. Okay. Later. Got in the car and headed for Dorjima's house. Not that we needed his address, I guess. Morel. And then two Kanji. I can't get Kanji. In the bus central shopping district. Gas station. Hi, welcome to Mall. Can you go to the bathroom by yourself? Uh, uh huh. Oh, okay. For a second there, there was talking to me, and it's just like I'm a teenager. It's in the back to your left. You know which way is left? The side you don't hold your chopsticks in. Why are you assuming she's right-handed? She could be left-handed. You idiot! You fool Are you of an attendant! A trip? No, we just went to pick him up. He just moved here from the big city. A city, huh? Fill up my car while you're at it. Regular's fine. Right away, sir. Good time as any for a smoke. <laughs> you are Are you in high school? Cigarette. Does it surprise a city boy to see how little there is out here? There's so little to do. I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. Speaking of which, we're actually looking for part-time help right now. I don't want to work for you. Give it some thought, why don't you? We don't mind if you're a student. <laughs> I'm easily oh, amused. I should get back to work. Nanako is looking at you. Are you okay? I Did find you, you suspicious. You don't look too good. You feel a little dizzy. What curse are you placing on me, little girl? What's wrong? You okay? Your daughter is cursing me. That's understandable. It must have been a long trip for you. Why not take a little walk? Get some fresh air. Just let me know when you're ready to go. Ooh. Explode the town. All right here. Why, why don't you take a walk and get some fresh air? Stopping district is near the house, so you should get to know where all the stars are. This is nice music. Next bus isn't going to come for a while. 
Maybe you missed one, boss. You're pretty screwed. If only I had a motorbike. I could go anywhere I wanted, anytime I wanted. I wonder how much they cost. Maybe I'll be able to buy myself one. George and I was waiting for you. You should wander off too far. Can I just take the bus? Ah. You have no reason to use the bus right now. Why must you be so judgy, game? Ooh, it's a bookstore. This is the bookstore. Thanks. It's fairly empty inside. Dang. That works. Here's the man who is single-mindedly pounding on something in the back of the store. He decided not to enter. Ooh, tofu saw. Hey, do you know where my snack went? I had it in the fridge, but it's gone. Oh, I ate it just now. I thought it was leftovers. What? No, it wasn't leftovers. I was making sure to save it for later. Oh, really? Sorry about that. Well, I'm going to work. See ya. What? I was really looking forward to eating it. They seem to be having a sibling dispute. You should leave me be. Wow, your lives are dull. Hey, I live here now. Hmm, I like this shop. It's very nice. It's inconvenient. Inconvenient at the same time. There's a delicate balance. This is what I expect country life to be like. Right, products line themselves. Can we look in our base? It's behind the counter. Can I go to the district? Ah! Can I talk to you already? Do you have something to do in this shopping district? It's a bit run down, but we have everything here. It used to be a lot more prosperous back in the day, but we only see regulars nowadays. If only Junes hadn't come into town. It's convenient, but it's a little sad. Okay, how many save files do I get? 16. earlier? Hmm? Have we met before? I met you just now. What were you doing at the station? It's just your imagination. The station? Oh, that one time. Nothing. I just went. I don't have anywhere to go. The girl falls silent. Well, that was... That was nothing. I learned nothing from you. Or about you. Anything else I can interact with? Uh, are you okay? Nanako seems worried about you. Hope so. You're evil! It's gonna be behind it all, I bet. How are you feeling? Ready to get back in the car? Yeah, I did everything. Alright, let's hit the road then. Join events, press backlog button to see the log, and skip event button to skip the event entirely. Well, here's our old looking place. In our old looking town. Yeah, I arrived at the Dojima residence. Be your home. Afternoon, evening. All right, let's have a toast. Ooh, I like toast. Oh, you meant dumb drink lifting. So, your mom and dad are busy as always. They're working overseas, was it? I guess that's I know how it's only for a year, that. but getting stuck in a place like this because of your parents? That's rough being a kid. Well, you it's live just here. me and Nanako here, so it'll be nice having someone like you around. So long as you're here, you're part of the family. So make yourself at home. This is a very friendly opening for a persona. I get, oh, 
do just that. Thank you for your kindness, which feels overly formal. Yes, so, sir, which is kind of against the whole you're part of the family thing. Or soul in silence. I guess we can go with generic. Oh, do just that. I mean, part of me wants to play the jerk, but we don't really have a jerk option besides not responding. So I guess we'll be not a jerk. <laughs> Come on. There's no need to be so formal. I do what I want. Look, you're making Nanako all tense. Well, anyway, let's eat. Why am I just wearing a oh, denim? Who's calling at this hour? What is your job? Dojima speaking. You giant mm -hmm. headed freak. Yeah, I see. So, where is it? Uh huh. All right, I'm on my way. Looks like I made the right choice to skip the booze. Sorry, but I gotta go take care of some business. Go ahead and eat without me. What is your business? I don't know how late I'll be. Nanako, you help him out, okay? Okay. Now the death games begin. Okay. Nanako, it's raining out. What did you do with the laundry? I already brought it in. All right. Well, I'm off. So Next, the dad let's take a look at the hourly breakdown of tomorrow's weather. With storm clouds moving in from the west, expect rain throughout the day tomorrow in most areas. Let's eat. Do I have to? Oh crap, I was actually wondering that! Fine game, play into my... Inquisitive nature. Investigate stuff. Like crime scenes. Oh, he's a policeman. My dad's a detective. Ah. And now for the local news. City Council Secretary, Taro Namatame, is under fire for an alleged relationship with a female reporter. His wife, Enka Ballad Sensation Misuzu Haragi, revealed to this station that she will likely pursue damages. In response, that is my going to cause television has decided to, to cancel power. all of announcer Mayumi Yamano's televised appearances. Until allegations of an affair with Mr. Namatame are resolved, she'll remain off the air and out of the public eye. This is boring. Yeah. At Tunis, every day is Customer Appreciation Day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Juness. Every day's great at your Juness. Aren't you going to eat? I'm a static crop. I cannot eat. I can use the calendar to save. I guess we'll do that. Save often, save early. Rotate saves, I guess. Hmm. Let's raid the fridge. I was joking, but cool. Eat it? Uh, I do like fried rice, but I don't want to be a bad house guest. But they did say me treat myself like family. So did I eat their fried rice? Did I eat their fried rice? I am being told not to eat his fried rice. <laughs> because it isn't used very often, the kitchen is organized. If there were ingredients in the refrigerator, you might be able to make lunch. All right, Namiko. Oh, um, Namiko was at a loss. You should leave her alone. Can't turn that off. Can I go upstairs? I cannot go up. Oh, I can go upstairs. Don't want to go upstairs. Let's go to entrance. Tired from the long trip. 
<laughs> it's gonna be rocking around outside. Ah, lame. Screw it, I'm eating the fried rice. Ah, oh, nom, 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 nom. It has no taste at all. Strange. Can I eat more fried rice? Alrighty. I guess I'll go to my room then. This is the room you're borrowing from Dorjima. I That's a weird way to phrase that sentence. You're tired from the long trip. You should rest. I was looking at a cell! Why am I total to rest from looking at a cell? <laughs> Uton TV. Your room. Uton. Work table. Nah. Got a couch. Got a futon. Ooh, sorry desk. Nah. Fine. Good night, I guess. I mean, I don't want to, but the game's clearly making me. Because I'm so tired from my long train trip. You'll be living in this town for one year, starting today. After one year, I, your grandfather will come along and see how you did with the farm. You wonder if everything will be alright. School starts tomorrow? You should hurry to bed. Ellipses. Oh, good. I'm lost in the vast, honorable, foggy land of my mindscape. Oh, so I'm st standing on a bunch of Rubik's Cubes? I get the feeling someone's about to challenge me to a dance fight. This is... The area is covered in a thick fog. All you can do right now is proceed forward. Uh, no. Oh. Okay, guess I'm doing that as... Oh, wait. Haha, -ha! jerks on you. I don't have to go forward if I don't want to. I can't go back. Can I go left? Can I go right? Yeah. Uh, event. No? All right. Always try to break the game. Always find the secrets. Oh, we're in the mind palace of the uh, second generation Pokemon rival. Ah! Do I seek the truth? Okay. I... I don't even get an answer to be snarky about. If it's truth you desire, come and find me. You hear the voice from up ahead. Uh, I mean, I guess I can go back, but that probably won't get me much. Haha, <laughs> joke's on you, game. I can backtrack. Uh, backtracking's boring. Illusion of choice. You've got a thin path to walk. Ooh, that looks fun. Can I eat it? You sent someone ahead. Will you continue? No! Yes! Yay, I'm about to be eaten by a square! Oh, is this a fight? It's a fight! I get a sword! Sir, you're the one pursuing me. I... I guess? <laughs> Try are you like. Nice head roll. I'm just gonna attack, I guess? 
I mean, that's rude. We're just mad, but... Hmm. Seems like you can see a litter despite the fog. Uh, guard. I see. Indeed. That is very interesting for information. Skill? Seer, cleave, rakukaja. It increases one ally's defense for three turns. Lame. Uh, I'm gonna lightning you. Oh, good. I'm not suing myself in the head to do magic this time. But you will try. You will not catch me so easily. If what you seek is truth. Your search will be even harder. I'm about to die, aren't I? I... Hello? Oh. No one sees what they want to. And the fog only deepens. Will we meet again? At a place other than here. <laughs> I look forward to it. I'm losing consciousness! No! But I'm already unconscious! And now it's the 12th of 2011. Wait, it's 2020. 2011 is not actually, is actually relatively Breakfast a while ready. ago. Ah, someone's talking to me. It's almost time to get off. Breakfast ready. It is time to get up. You feel like you had a nightmare, but you're not sir. I guess I'm starting school today. Do some head to the living room for now. Street toast! Good morning. Let's run down the road. This is like actual breakfast. Okay, let's eat. I was under the impression Japanese people don't have actual breakfast as Westerners do. Do you do the cooking? Yeah, let's stop talking about your dad. I can toast bread and cook sunny side up eggs in the morning. Dad can't cook, so I buy dinner. You're starting school today, right? My school's on the way, so let's go together. Seems somewhat restless. You decide to head to school with Nanako. What if I want to be a truant, though? What if I don't want to go to school? Goal zone. You keep going straight from here. I'm gonna go jump in a river. My school's this way. Bye. The, why didn't? Okay. Why didn't you just give me directions to keep heading this way and go to, to your and stop at your school? Like, why did you oversuit your school? <laughs> yeah, I intersect in front of the school. Got garbage. Get a raincoat. I should leave him be. Yes, gotta be a jerk. never had gates. At least not fancy gates like this. Turn, turn, die oh, Hey, it's been I a while. I'm so sorry. Oh, yeah. yeah, it turns I out that I'm studying at a Ah, uh, talk about bad luck. The homeroom teacher here is Moraoka, isn't it? Yeah, it's King Moron, all right. We get to really? enjoy his long-ass sermons every day for a whole year. What's your language? Hey, you guys, I heard there's going to be a transfer student from the city in this class. Huh? Really? A guy or a girl? A transfer student from the city? Just like you, huh, Yosuke? Huh? You look dead today. Maybe he is yeah. dead, latent um, protagonist I don't girl. Talk about it. What's with him? Who knows? Why is our school uniforms freaking denim? All right, shut your traps. Wow. I'm I hate Kinshiro you Moraoka, your homeroom teacher from today forward. 
First things first. Just because it's spring doesn't mean you can swoon over each other like love-struck baboons. Long as I'm around, you students are going to be pure as the driven snow. You're creepy. Now, I hate wasting my time, but I'd better introduce this transfer student. This sad sack's been thrown from the big city out to the middle of nowhere like yesterday's garbage. And he's just as much of a Do loser here as he was there. So you girls better not get any ideas about hitting on him. I Tell him your name, kid, and make it quick. Yeah, you know what? No, you get lip. Yay, cards increased. Huh. That's it. You're on my shit list. Effective immediately. I, now I listen up. That's not this very town is miles away from your big city of perverts and assholes in more ways than one. Did you something better happen not to even you? think of getting involved with the girls here, let alone abusing them. Who do you what think I am? am? It's not like the old days. Even here, kids grow up so damn fast. Every like, time I turn my back, you're fooling around on those damn phones, checking your life journals and your my places. You need help. Excuse me, is it okay if the transfer student sits here? Huh? Yeah, sure. You hear that? Your seat's over there. So hurry up and sit down already. But that's not the designated protagonist seat. That's like in the middle of the classroom. That's not how this is supposed to work. The worst, huh? Rotten luck for you to get stuck in this class. Well, we just have to hang in there for a year. Okay. People can Sucks talk about to be me. the transfer student ending up in King Moron's class on the first morning here. Hey, you are well, also he here. He think twice about suspending you if you get on his bad side. Then again, we're all in the same boat. Shut your traps. I'm taking roll, and I damn well expect you to respond in an orderly manner. Will you be able to fit in here? I think I already do. Like, it seems really easy. As long as you're against that guy, everyone's on your side. That's all for today. Normal lectures will start tomorrow. Later. You should go see a dentist. Attention all teachers. Please report immediately to the faculty office for a brief staff meeting. All students must return to their classrooms and are not to leave the school until further notice. Okay. Ugh. You heard the announcement. Don't go anywhere until you hear otherwise. Got it. I'm a protagonist. I'm going to go where I want. Or so we have two trains over He's here. He's seriously getting on my nerves. If you say so, brown haired girl. Did something happen? Don't those sirens sound really close? Ah, I can't see a damn thing. Freaking fog. Yeah, like every time it rains lately, it gets all foggy. Hey, did you hear? I hear that paparazzi's looking all over for that announcer. Oh, huh, yeah. You mean Mayumi Yamano, right? I heard some guy spotted her at the shopping district. Actually, I heard that. These are you serious? Are hilarious. <laughs> hey, hey Yukiko-san. Mind if I ask you something? Is it true that announcer staying at your family's inn? Do I know I this can't voice? Discuss such things. Yeah, I guess not. Well, I tried. Goodbye. Oh, sheesh. How much longer is this gonna take? I mean, no someone telling. probably got murdered. I should have so. left before the announcement came on. By like, the you way, know what came on like right after the, the guy speeds. You know, that thing about rainy nights. Oh, no, not yet. Sorry. Ah, uh, that's okay. It's just I heard a guy in the class next door yell something like, "My soulmate is Yamino, the announcer." Attention, all students. There has been an incident inside the school district. Police officers have been dispatched around the school zone. Please stay calm and contact your parents or guardians as soon as possible and quickly leave the school grounds. Do hey. not disturb the police officers. Head directly home. All right, who wants I to go repeat. disturb some police officers with me? Incident? What? Something actually happened? You did come actually on, repeat. Let's go take a look. Are you 
going home by yourself? Why don't you come with us? Oh, nearly forgot. I'm Chie Satonaka. You know, I sit next to you, right? You do? Dude, I was sitting right next to you. I even talked to you. Anyways... This is Yukiko Amagi. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm sorry that this is so sudden. Come on, don't apologize like that. It makes me look like I got no upbringing. Oh, I just wanted to ask some stuff, really. That's all. Hey, you ran into a sign on the uh, way to school? Um, Miss Satanaka, this was really awesome. Like, the way they moved was just amazing to see. Well, you... And... I'm really sorry. It was an accident. Please just have mercy until my next paycheck. I... See ya. Thanks. Stop right there. What did you do to my DVD? Ah! Well, I guess these are my friends. What the? I can't believe this. It's completely cracked. Oh, my trial of the dragon. I think mine's cracked, too. Critical hit to the Neds. Uh, are so that's you right? anime like that. Oh, Yukiko-san. Are you worried about me? And can He's fine, Gross. Yukiko. And considering Let's this is the second time home. you've gone through the anime, so I don't think you get to have kids anymore. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> the game doesn't even let me choose to be a jerk about it. It's just like, yeah, no, we get it. You're going to be a jerk to this dude. You're Yuki, right? Y you want to go hang out somewhere? What is wrong what? with your face? Wh who are you? Fight, fight, What's up fight. With him? What school's he from? Never mind that. He's going for Yukiko-san? Man, you'd think he'd at least wait until she's alone to make his move. I bet you a can of tap he gets knocked out. No bet. Haven't you heard how difficult the Amagi challenge is? Oh, we are like so less than are five feet away. <laughs> I I'm not going. Fine. Bye. What? what? What did he want from me? What did he want? Uh, obviously he was asking you out on a date. Huh? Really? You really had no clue? Sheesh. But then again, that was way over the top. It was creepy how he called you Yuki all of a sudden. I know, calling her by her name? Yo, Yukiko-san. Who does that? Turn down another lovelorn fool, huh? Man, you're cruel. You got me the same way last year. What is your name? I don't recall doing that. Oh, are you serious? So then you want to hang out sometime? I'd rather not. That'll teach me to get my hopes up. Anyways, you two better not pick on the transfer student too much. We're just curious is all. Curious and what? I'm sorry for dragging you into this. So Come we're on, let's go. Building Everyone's up a staring. crowd. Walking on mug. Da da da. Da 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 da. Ooh, a dog. Oh. So you came here because of your parents' job? <laughs> I thought it was something way more serious. Yeah, no, that's not until the next game. There really is nothing here, huh? That's what makes it nice. But there is nothing much we can show to people from outside. Though there is something from Mount Yasagami. I think our dyed clothes or pottery or something is kind of famous. <laughs> oh, wait! And there's the Amagi Inn! Yeah, that, family that strikes uh, uh, true for small Inaba. towns. Huh? It's just an old inn. No way! It's been in all sorts of magazines as a hidden treasure! It's a great inn! It's been going for generations, and Yukiko here is gonna take over someday. Their I, inn I already actually have a attracts place a lot stay? of visitors to Inaba. It pretty much keeps this town going. Wow. I don't think that's entirely that's true. powerful. So, tell me. You think Yukiko's cute, huh? That is very straightforward. I don't want to be straightforward. I'm just going to say it's hard to say because I don't care. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to put you on the spot right in front of her. Come on, don't start this again. She's really popular at school. I but picked she's that up. never had a boyfriend. 
kind of weird, huh? <laughs> Come it's on, your stop business. it. You shouldn't believe that, okay? It's not true that oh, I'm popular nice or that like I've never a had a boyfriend. Wait, no, no, no. What I meant to say was I, I don't need a boyfriend. Okay. Jeez, GA. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. But this is our chance to talk to someone from the big city. And you barely said a word. Like, I'm hey, a silent protagonist, that? so it's not like you're going to get much from me. All right, how many dead bodies do we have? So that high schooler left school early, and as she came down this street... Wow, who could imagine that hanging from an antenna? I wanted to see it too. Oh, you got here too No, late. this checks out for women. The police women. and fire department took it down just a moment ago. Well, I think it's terrifying. Just I can't believe a dead body showed up around here. Stuff. Wait, what did she just say? A dead body? Don't get too excited. Hey, what are you doing here? Did something happen? Changing the, slightly changing the subject. We were curious. Not true. We were just passing by. Huh. I should have figured that had happened. That damn principal. We told him not to let them through here. You know this guy? This is my uncle. I'm Detective Dojima, his guardian. Uh, well, how should I say this? I hope you get along with them. But you three really ought to stop wandering around and head straight home. Bye. <coughs> Adachi, how long are you going to act like a rookie? You want to be sent back to the central office? I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh, go wash your face. We're going to go around and gather information. He seems like a fun guy. Was this what that announcement was about? Probably. What do they mean it was hanging from the antenna? Hey, Yukiko. Why don't we go to Juness some other time? Good idea. All right, then. We're taking off. Starting tomorrow, neighbor, let's do our best. I have a name, which you did not ask for. Which no one's asked for. What if I don't want to head away from the crime scene? What if I want to stay here and, like, make sandcastles? Oh. Where do I want to go? Go back to the school. Hey, you. Don't you know there's an order to go home? What if you get caught up in something bad? Go straight home, you hear? Are you just. Do you just speak entirely in Terabang? Let's go to the shopping district. Hey, Mr. The Police. You're a student, Yasugami! You should have got in order to go home from school today. This voice is completely off character. Go on, go home. No, I do what I want. I'm a protagonist. There's a bit of a ruckus. And there's a lot of police officer. What's going on? Huh? A crime? Really? Yay! An emergency! Now I don't have to go back to work! Yeah, I'm on your side with that one. all day today. Oh, sleepy young man. I was getting such great sleep, but they woke me up. <sighs> yeah, 
Yay, North District. It seems this is a Chinese restaurant. You can smell the appetizing scent of fruit from here. There's a bulletin board. We'll catch up, openings. There are no job openings at the moment. Look at the poster. Samega Sa Samegawa. Boju. Misuzu Hiragi. It's a poster of a famous in Inca singer. Didn't they tell you at school? You're supposed to head straight home. Sir, where did the store's owner go? Can't leave here until I've talked to him. Maybe the store owner's the one who died. Hi! It's a little unbelievable to see so many policemen in this town. This has never happened before. To a shrine! It's a small shrine. There's a fortune box laying there. There's nothing inside. You have no business here. It's not even a play place. I'm getting the feeling from this game that they want me to go home. Going out business sale! They're bothering all the policemen because I'm a weirdo. Yes, that's right. I'm in front of the store owned by the parents. Yes, I understand. I'll get to it now. Huh? No, no. Like I explained already. It's a liquor store. Stop the hey, it's Mr. Hee Ho. Jack Frost. I know his name's Jack Frost. The bicycle star, but the stars are closed. Stop is closed. Yes. Okay. Who do I harass next? To the Junes. Hi. Stuff, what? There were policemen in us. It's time to scare me later, so I just called my husband to pick us up. You must be a student at your Yasugami High. It would be terrible if anything happened to you. So maybe you should hurry on home. I do what I want! Oh. Game won't let me do what I want. Yeah, I'll leave my genius. To the floodplain! Isn't this river something? It's called the Samegawa. Hey, I know that one! Isn't that, uh... No, he's got his head on the one. Isn't Samigara, like, the dragon from Spirited Away? No. The river is that. No, that can't be right. Where do I recognize Samegawa, Samegawa from then? Mimi's having a fun time. Samegawa, or whatever. Or however that's correctly spelled. Katana's for sale. 
River. Uh, <laughs> the first result I get is freaking the Me Megami Tensei wiki. Hmm. What if I add anime? I'm pretty sure I've heard it mentioned somewhere. No, it looks like it's mostly just Persona 4. All right. Haku River. Gonna solve all the mysteries. Uh, da, 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 da. Disney Wiki. Uh, so the Kohaku Nusi River, I guess. Okay. Well, what did we learn? Nothing. It's a wonderful, beautiful river. I keep seeing police cars zooming by. Is there some kind of accident? Persona has good music. Out of fishing rod, you may be able to fish here. Alright. Japanese game, so there has to be a fishing game somewhere in it. Which is how it works. Keep hearing the blue sirens today. I'm not used to all that noise. It's really unsettling. <laughs> Yes! Ooh, can I grow up these things? No. Dang it. Yeah. If I finally... Fine, I'll go home, game. Why give me the options? Ooh, we should steal this moped. It was terrible. I was doing some work on the farm and the police came around to crest in me. It says the dangerous work these days. I can't even relax when I go out shopping. And I was going to buy some Thai soul tomato for dinner tonight too. What now? Oh, that's no problem. Here, you can have some that I harvested from my garden. It's no big thing. Anyone can start a home garden, as long as they have some unused land to work with. You take that spot next to the Dojima place, for example. That's more than enough land to make a fine garden. Who oh my, is that so? Hint, hint, player! If they start a home garden too, does that mean I can look forward to them sharing the vegetables they grow? Hint, hint, chuckle, chuckle. So, yes, I guess. We'll return home. Don't look at the camera, girl. I wonder if Dad's not coming home again tonight. Is this a common problem with your household? Our top story this evening concerns a bizarre case in a quiet suburb. Are Around you a suburb? Today, a woman was found dead near the Samegawa River in Inaba. Aw. School zone is being shown on TV. Cool. Could this be the incident you heard about? Nah, that's impossible. The deceased has been identified as Miss Mayumi oh. Yamano, a 27-year-old announcer at the local television station. The initial results of the Inaba Police Department's investigation have revealed... Murder! Uh, the, the Inaba Police Department! That's where Dad works! <sighs> really? Uh, it'll be alright. I know. That's his job, so this stuff happens. 
Does, the body does this stuff really happen? Large television antenna atop a local resident's roof. Authorities are uncertain yeah. as to why the body was in such a state. With the cause of death also uncertain, police continue to investigate whether the death is an accident or a homicide. A thick fog common to the area has slowed their progress, and plans to fully canvas the area are delayed until tomorrow. Wait, what? So that canvas have been spelled with two S's? Does it look a TV set? We were just told that? Yes, all this we know. They found her on the roof? That's scary. Why are you watching the news? Oh, it's Juness. At Juness, every day is customer appreciation day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Juness. That's not every day's great at your Juness. You memorized it already? <laughs> I'm the best one in my class. Is there something sinister about Junis? Wow. Are we friends yet? I don't know. Do you do anything except watch television? Fried rice. Let's escape. Ah. Fine. Yeah, it's Wednesday the thirteenth of twenty eleven. Did this game game come out in twenty eleven? Okay, you're no longer allowed to ride your bike. <laughs> you saved me. Thanks. Um. Thanks. Oh yeah, that's right. You're just pitiful. You're that transfer student. I'm Yosuke Hanamura. Oh, they actually nice slipped the name you. in there. Are you okay? Is your bike okay? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Seems to be alright. Say, did you hear about the incident from yesterday? They found that announcer lady hanging from an antenna. You think Creepy. it was some kind of warning? There's no way something that would have been from an accident. Who? Dangling a dead body over a roof like that? That's just messed up. Then again, it's pretty messed up to kill someone in the first place. Oh crap, we're late. You want to ride? It's a little squeaky, but it should be fine. I... They're not going to tell us how they managed that, are they? Okay. Uh, yes, you're pointedly in high school. Not really. And I'll be going especially hard on any of you morons that are curious about the murder. Got it? Now get your books out. I listened to the lecture intently. Yay, my knowledge has increased. Yay, it's morning! It's after school! So, you getting used to this place? I guess. Yeah, it's a school. They're mostly the same. Wow, that was fast. There isn't much to do here compared to the big city. But there is that certain something you can't get anywhere else. The air is clean, what? the food's great. Is it? Oh, you know about the local delicacy? It's grilled steak, man. Like, that's anything special, huh? I know a place where you can get it cheap. Want to come? 
You helped me out this morning, so it's on me. What about me, huh? No apologies? For what? No oh, right, the right. Dragon. Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> That's you fair. You always come around when I'm talking about food. How about it, Yukiko? Don't you think he should treat us too? What? Why are you dragging me into this? I'll pass. I don't want to gain any more weight. I need to help out at the inn today anyway. Wow, Yukiko-san. You started training to take over the business? It's not like that. I'm just helping out when it gets busy. Well, I should be on my way. Oh well, we should get going too. Huh? Do I seriously have to treat two people? I mean, you can treat one. I'm not. I don't really personally enjoy steak. I mean, the protagonist might, but I don't. But... Wait, we're getting the steak from a chain. This is the cheap store? place you were talking about. Ugh, they don't have grilled steak here. Yeah, well, once you hopped on the freeloader train, I had to change my plans. Still, that's no reason to take us to your place. Dude, this isn't my place or anything. What? Oh, right. I haven't told you yet, huh? I moved here from another city about six months back. This location right. just opened up and my dad was assigned to manage it. Oh, so okay. our entire family came out here. Here. This is to welcome you to town. Sadonaka, yours is on me too. Yeah, I know. I find she kind of annoying. It's just like a litter too grass. Over small talk. It's only been half a year since this place opened up, but I haven't been to the local shopping district much since. A lot of stores there started closing and ooh, uh You can't blame it all on Juness, can you? <sighs> she looks sad. Hey, it's Saki Senpai. Sorry, be right back. He, oh wait, senpai. Wait. Yeah, okay. Senpai? Sensei is the teacher. Uh, suffix. Who's that? That's Saki Kanishi. Her family runs a liquor store in the shopping district. Oh yeah, I saw I it. She's it was working closed. here part time though. Hey, how's it going? You look beat. Hey. I'm finally on break. What's up, Hanachan? Boosting the family business by bringing your friends here? Ugh. Madam, you wound me. Kidding aside, you look down. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just a little tired. Hey, if you need to talk, I'm always willing to listen. I... <laughs> I'm okay. Thanks, though. Ugh. Why did I leave school early yesterday? Oh, you, you saw the body? Hey, is he the kid who transferred here? No, let's backtrack a bit about the fact that you found the corpse. Are you the transfer student? Oh, <laughs> did you hear about me already? It must Very be nice great. to have someone else from the big city to talk to, huh? I don't see I, Hanachan I don't hanging out with the other him. guys much. Well, not necessarily. He doesn't have too many friends, so I hope you two get along good. Hanachan's uh. a good guy, but he can get nosy sometimes. You gotta tell him right to his face when he starts to annoy you. Yeah, he's annoying. <laughs> All right, break it up. You're kind of getting on my nerves. Well, my break's just about over. Back to work I go. Later. Oh, uh, I'm just going to choose all the wrong choices this time, aren't I? <laughs> Saki-senpai says I'm annoying, but she's even nosier than me. She has a younger brother, and she treats me pretty much the same way. Oh, you don't want her treating you like a brother, huh? <laughs> I get it. So that's how it is. The daughter of a local family-run liquor store, and the scion of the invading chain. Ho oh, ho! The flame of forbidden love. Dude, it's not like that. Yeah, he has a cross on what's her name. Well, I know just the thing to cheer up that lovesick heart. 
You ever hear of the Midnight Channel? You're supposed to look into a TV that switched off, alone, exactly at midnight on a rainy night. While you're staring at your own image, another person will appear on the screen. And they say that person's your soulmate. What? For a second, I thought you were actually going to say something useful. How can you get all excited over such a childish urban legend like that? Childish, huh? You don't believe it, do you? Of course I don't. Well, it's raining tonight. Let's all try it out. Then you'll see. Try it out? Wait, you haven't even tried it yourself? Wow. I'm trying to remember the last time I heard something this stupid. All that aside, you know that incident yesterday? You guys think it was murder? Ooh, what if the culprit behind it was still lurking around? <laughs> Jeez, you shouldn't joke about stuff like that. Now who's the child? You're all the childish all I'm ones. Is, you guys better try it out tonight. I don't know if I care about a soulmate. I mean, I guess that's how the game progresses. After school evening. Another dinner alarm with Nanako. No, he always says he will. Oh, he's home! Let it be someone else. Let me see her heart just shatter on oh, it. What a day. Hi. I'm back. Did anything happen while I was out? No. Well, you're late again. I'm sorry. I'm busy at work. I have angry brows. Can you put the news on for me? Can't you do anything, old man? Making your child Next, do everything. Next, more details in the developing story on the incident in Foggy Inaba. Announcer Mayumi Yamano's dead body was found hanging above a house in this isolated rural town. It is confirmed that Miss Yamano had been involved in an affair with Taro Namatame, husband of Enka singer Misuzu Hiragi. I do not care about the rumors. Cool. I mean, it's a small town. I guess we have nothing else going on. Councilman Secretary. Yes, we already know this. Stop repeating this incident ad nauseum. The police plan to investigate this relationship and question any personnel involved with them. In addition, we now bring you an exclusive interview with the local student who found Miss Yamano's body. Uh, an interview with a kid? Uh, where the hell did they find her? What went through your mind when you saw it? Could you tell she was dead? Did you see her face? Uh, wow, our uh, newspaper people are garbage. Yep, there's no way we can tell who it is. Yes, it's Don't obvious who it's it is. Don't you think it's scary that someone was killed on a foggy day? Huh? She was killed? Oh, uh, so did you see anyone suspicious around here? No, not really. We heard that you found it when you left school early. Did you have some personal business to take care of? Huh? That's... Irrelevant. This is a terrible reporter. Yes, that was obvious, A tragedy game. that occurred near the local shopping district. Many store owners are raising concerns about losing customers as a result. <laughs> if they lose more customers, it'll be because you're making such a stink about it. It really is a bizarre case, isn't it? I mean, hanging someone upside down from an antenna. <laughs> I'd have to say it's a warning or a sign from the culprit. Yes, but so far, no one has come forward to take credit for the crime. Wow. Oh, loads of prank calls, though. So the cause of death is still unknown, and they don't have a single suspect yet? Taxpayers' funds are going to a police force who can't even figure out if this is an accident or a homicide. It literally happened yesterday. <sighs> Give the coroner we'll right time! After these messages. At Juness, every day is Customer Appreciation Day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day is great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. Hey, Dad, can we go to Juness together sometime? <laughs> this family unit makes no? me sad. Jeez. You 
were very lonely before I came along, weren't you? No, he needs to interact with his kid. Be a father for once. Going out. Da. Da. Fine, I'll go upstairs. The rain falls into the night. I did make that promise for some reason. Well, let's see if you're in your room. Yeah, all right. It's almost midnight. I have to wait for rain and night. It's going to make it difficult to do the dungeons. I look almost completely different in this anime cutscene. <laughs> Holy cow! Vocalization for our protagonist! I mean, it would probably just the, you know, lightning star messing with the liquor electronics. Okay, like, that's kind of what you get for poking a t television. And now the TV's eating me. And now I have a concussion. Today sucks. Are you okay? The TV tried to eat me! Help! <laughs> Did it wake you up? I heard a really loud noise. Yeah. Well, good night. Good night. <laughs> Yay. So, what did we learn, Mr. Protagonist? Now it's a Thursday. Sorry. Perfect timing. Sorry, move over. Chie forced herself under your umbrella. Uh, get your own umbrella? <laughs> I'm not really in the mood for soup cheesing at the moment. I did have my own, but I saw this kung fu movie where they used an umbrella to pull off some street moves. And... I accidentally broke mine trying to mimic the move. You're an idiot. By the way, did you see it? The Kung Fu movie? You know, the thing we were talking about yesterday, that Midnight Channel. Did you? Never mind, we're saving for when the others are around. We're gonna be late for school. Um. Oh, uh, uh, it's kind of awkward to only bring this up now, but we're pretty close here. Yeah, I know. That's why I said I didn't want to do the sipping nonsense. But you didn't listen. Uh, I'm going to just go ahead and run the rest of the way. In this race! Huh? 
sir, I'm I'm gonna be inconsistent with inconsistent protagonist, man. Am I oblivious? Am I crazy? Who knows? It doesn't matter. What's the point in that? Besides, it's not like I wanted to make a break for it. Kinda of sounded like you did. Anyways, I'm gonna run now and just leave you leave you behind since you're just gonna be like I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> I but Come on. a race! A race though! Oh. Alright, what's our stupid teacher up to? Ah what? Wait, what? Are all the history teachers in these games, like, crazy and into weird head gear? Because the history teacher in Persona 3 had, like, a samurai helmet. Hello, everyone. My name is Kimiko Sufure. And I don't know how much you know about world history, but I'm an expert, as you can tell by my freaking fairer head thing. First, a little about me. I love to use my dowser to look for lost items. There's nothing quite like a romance. In fact, court history is a magnificent romance. History is like a river. It was born in the past and flows every forward. I hope we can all enjoy the profundity of history together. Ho ho ho! And since this is my first lecture, I'll start with an easy question. Our chance free, Mr. Arakawa. Please stand up. All right. The Western calendar is based on Eno Domini, the traditionally believed year of Jesus Christ's birth. What is the year before 1 AD card? Uh, negative 1 AD. I mean, it's 1 BC, right? There's no 0 AD. You gave the answer you think is correct. Ah, oh, you seem to understand this well. Yes, math is easy. If you think that history is like math, Sarah AD would be the natural assumption. But world history is much more complicated. The Gregorian calendar we use today is based on the Julian calendar. Which was made, well, there was no concept of the zero as a number. That's right, when counting backwards, we go from 1 AD straight to 1 BC. That was a nice introduction to world history. I gave the correct answer. Not that it was difficult. And all this has increased. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, after school. I'm What's up with the body being hung upside down? Bag. That's so freaky. Is Wait. it supposed to be like mimicking an execution? It's messed up. That's the hangman or Saki who found the body. Yo, um, yes, it's a, it's not really that important, but well, yesterday on TV, I, uh, I am tempted to just sandbag this. Oh, uh, you never mind. Look, I'll tell you later. <laughs> did your TV Yosuke, try to eat you? Did you hear you? the rumor? Saki Senpai is supposedly the one who discovered that body. Yeah, you didn't pick I that up when we met her yesterday. So she doesn't seem to be at school today either. Yeah, that's huh? traumatic. Hey, Yukiko, are you helping out at the inn today, too? Things are really out of hand right now. I'm sorry. Bye. Is it just me, or does Yukiko-san seem way stressed out today? I mean, someone I got murdered nearby. Ragged. By the way, also, did the you see thing. it last night? Huh? Uh, well, what about you? I did! I seriously saw a girl, but... Your soulmate's a girl? My soulmate's a girl? What's that supposed to mean? I couldn't quite tell who it was, but it was a girl for sure. Her well, hair I guess was brown about shoulder length. Discoveries about she you. was wearing our school uniform, and... Hey, I think that's the same person I saw. I couldn't make out that much detail, though. We all have the, the image same I saw soulmate? Was much blurrier. Wait, so you saw it too? And we saw the same girl? Does that mean we have the same soulmate? How should I know? How about you? Did you see it? Tell them about what happened last night. The TV tried to eat me. 
It was scary. It sounds like we all saw the same person. Arthur, but the television tried aside, to eat me. What was that about getting sucked into your TV? Were you that tired Good. last night? You must have just fallen asleep in front of your TV. That'd be one interesting dream, though. I like the part where you got stuck because your TV was too small. <laughs> That's pretty realistic. If it had been bigger... I... Oh, that reminds me. Our family's been talking about buying a bigger TV. Oh, yeah? Well, flat screen TVs are definitely in these days. Want to go check them out on the way back? We're beefing up our electronics department this month. Oh, definitely. My parents don't know anything about electronics, and I've just got to see my kung fu movies on the big screen. <laughs> We've got some pretty big ones in stock. I bet they'd be big enough for Amy. you to fit into. <laughs> Uh, well, I guess that's what I get for poking things that, you know, I really shouldn't. No one would believe me that my television wanted to eat me. Wow! This is huge! And holy Those crap, it's expensive. Who buys something like this? Someone who needs I a big know. TV. Rich folks? Honestly, not many people shop for TVs here. That's why we don't have clerks around. Let's steal it. Huh. Not worth trying then, I guess. Well, at least looking's free. Or we can steal it. Let's steal this television. Yeah, get no. fingerprints all get over in. it. Figures. <laughs> this proves it. It was all just a dream. Besides, these flat screen TVs are so thin, you just end up on the other side. Ah, what am I saying? So, Chia, what kind of TV are you guys in the market for? They said they wanted one that's cheap. You got any suggestions? Why is this happening to me? When is the game actually going to start? <laughs> well, miss, uh, might I suggest this one over here? It's the newest model just released this spring. What? I that's didn't not come all this all. way to watch you guys play. There's way too many zeros. There's at I least should have one. asked what you meant by cheap right off the bat. You got connections, right? Come on, hook me up. No, I can't do that. Hey, how about this one over here? It's a display unit. It's a little old, but... TV this big? He really might be able to go into... Why do I want to go inside a television? Why can I not learn my lesson? What are you doing? Oh, yeah. Stop what that! What kind of TV do you... <laughs> Why are you going into the TV? Wrong, what is wrong with you? Is his arm in the TV? Whoa. Why am I able uh, to do this? Is that some kind of new model? Like L a magic trick, a you guys already function? touched it. So Hell you no. know it's real. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Did you really stick your hand through the screen? Oh, Yusuke, man. you got to ha help me. I can't That's pay so you back if I break man. this. So how's it work, huh? What's the magician's secret? I mean, eaten by a television. Why? Why would you? T <laughs> Why do you keep touching televisions doing weird things? What? Don't put your head in it! Oh my god! What is wrong with you? What do you mean inside? <laughs> what, what do you mean empty space? <laughs> this is the. <laughs> what is with my protagonist? I mean, what's going on? Who just bust oh, all, any of I this? I think this is all too much for my bladder. What the? Are you gonna pee your pants? <laughs> I've been holding it in all day. Why? I haven't had a chance to go. Just then I go. Whatever. I'll hold it deal with anymore. What? Why is this happening? Shit! Customers, they're coming. Oh, are what? you on the clock? Just go to the restroom. Pull me out? Alright, but what? Wait, wait what? Okay. <laughs> well, into the twilight zone, I guess. <laughs> and now I'm dead. <laughs> Ow. I landed right on my wallet. Man, you keep hurting yourself. Body. What is this place? Some place 
nice inside, Juness. Hell no, it isn't. I mean, we fell through a TV. Actually, uh, what is going on here? I'm not gonna explain it. I, uh, I'm apparently suicidally impulsive. Like, I need help. So, we're on a TV now. So, uh, we're still alive, right? I. <laughs> Are you guys okay? Yay, my understanding has increased. For some reason. I think my butt's cracked now. Uh, of course it is. Whoa. What now? Did you wet your pants? Stop no, focusing stupid. on his urine. Is this a studio? All this fog. Or... Is it smoke? There's no place like this in Inaba, is there? Hell no, but man, this place is huge. What are we gonna do? I guess die? Let's go home. Or we can put her in charge. Well, based off of our protagonist who stuck his head in it, he probably wants to look around. Let's look huh? around. But, but, look, we need to get home and... Huh? Wait a minute. Wait, which way did we come in from? Uh, Up. I don't see a way in or out. I guess this is our life now. What? That can't be right. How could that be? I don't know. Don't ask me. I can't take this anymore. I want to go home. Okay, so how? Let's calm down. Let's look for a way out. We're doomed! Yeah, an exit. We need to find one. Let's calm down and think about this. All right, so we need to find a way out. Duh. Is there really a way out of here? I mean, there was a got way in. in. So we must be able to get out somehow. Yeah, your has got my back. That's true, but... If there's no exit, we're trapped. So let's cross our fingers and look around. Right. Careful, that will lead you to Persona 5. What is this place? It feels different from where we were before. It looks like we're in some kind of building, but... Damn, this fog's so thick I can hardly see. Are you sure we're not wandering farther away? I can't be positive, but we gotta trust our instinct a little. I know, but... Why'd you continue onward? Well, let's stick our head into another weird portal. <laughs> it's worked out well for us so far. Okay, whose bedroom are we in? Hey. Is it me or is the fog lighter here? I mean, we're in no service. Room. What a surprise! Can you guys slow down a little? It's hard enough to see where you're going. Huh? What the? Someone did not it's like what's her name. There's no exit. It keeps getting creepier and creepier the further we go. I can't hold it any longer. All right, the bladder's gonna harder. explode. Yosuke, what are you doing? I gotta let it out before I piss my pants. You're going here? Oh, you have gotta be kidding. Look, this was a predetermined. Turn around! Oh, I can't go if everyone's watching. Uh, I can't do it. It's all your fault if my bladder bursts. Like I care. Could have gone to the restroom earlier. You're the one who got freaked out by seeing customers. Anyways, what's with this room? Check out these posters. Their faces are all cut out. We're like Someone Claude, must really hate this person. Dude, this chair and rope. That kind of arrangement is never good. It's tied in a noose. Is this a scarf? 
Come on, let's go back to where we came from and look somewhere else for an exit. Hey, I think I've seen that poster before. Who cares? <laughs> let's go! I'm sick of this place, and I'm not feeling so good. Do you arsonies? Now that you mention it, me too. Well, you have a full bladder. Alright, let's go back. Sure. I'm seriously starting to feel sick. Phew! We finally made it back here. Wait, what's that? There's something over there. Exist. What is this thing? A monkey? A bear? What in the world? That's what I want to know. Who are you guys? <gasps> it talked. W what are you? You want to fight? The don't yell at me like that. I don't care who he is. Let me just find out where I am. This place is what it is. It doesn't have a name. Well, that's lazy. It's right? where I live. You live here? If I was you guys, I'd hurry back to the other side. How? Someone's been throwing people in Dude, here. It's a here. big headache. Huh? Throwing people in? What are you talking about? I don't know who's doing it. I just want them to think before they go doing things like that. Hey, what's your problem? What gives you the right to yell at us like that? Well, we invaded his you? home. Where are we? What the heck is going on here? Great, he thinks I'm the uh, I already told you. Anyways, you should hurry back. How? What it comes down to is, you want us to get out of here, right? Well, so do we. We just don't know how, damn it. Uh, that's why I'm saying I'll let you out. Thanks. Like I keep saying, we don't know where the frickin' exit. Wait, what? Y'all have terrible hearing comprehension. <laughs> uh, what the hell? Okay. Where did those TVs come from? I don't know. Where are we? <laughs> like, stop crashing things at this point. Okay, now go, go. Get out of here. I'm a busy bear. What's going on now? Whoa! Hey! What are you doing? S stop pushing! <laughs> so, someone first what's her name into here. She got stuck in that room filled with images of Is this? the woman Did we that sees. Make it back? Uh, whatever. She got mad at the posters and then she hung herself. Attention shoppers! Our daily limited time sale will now begin at the side dish area on the first floor. Ooh, let's get some food! Why not try the delicious fresh produce Juness picked for you this morning as your side dish for dinner tonight? All ages are invited to take advantage of this incredible bargain. Crap, it's already that late? <sighs> Looks like we were in there for quite a while. That's right. Now I remember where I saw that poster before. Look over there. That's the poster we saw. What's up now? Hey, you're right. They're the same. I couldn't tell before without the face, but it was Misuzu Hiragi. She's been all over the news lately. Something about her husband having an affair with that announcer lady who died the other day. Okay, hey, so does that mean you put two and two together? Saw. Could it be related to that Yamano lady's death? Keep now going. I think about it. There was that creepy noose hanging from the ceiling. Right? Yeah, stop. No more. We gotta stop talking you about- You are so I'm close. Gonna what happened today from my brain. I don't think my poor heart can take anymore. I'm feeling a chill too. Let's go home. I want to lie down and rest. So close. 
Oh, that's it. Hey, tonight, I see. welcome home. Hey, I fell into a television and I got yelled at by a weird mascot character. Has that ever happened to you before? Um, well, I doubt you'd know. Did you but not have get you me heard ramen? anything about a student named Saki Konishi? She discovered the body. People feel sorry for her. She wasn't at school today. Yeah, yeah, this is be obvious. It's true. Well, to be honest, we got a call from her family. She's disappeared. We've got oh people looking for her, but she hasn't been found yet. All right, we'll have to go into the midnight show. <sighs> Work just keeps piling up. I mean, and now, you could more on the case still casting a shadow over the foggy heads. town of Inaba. Not long ago, television announcer Mayumi Yamano was found dead in the small town. Up until now. Her whereabouts prior to her death had been unknown, but the police investigation has found that she had been staying in the region's famous Amagi Inn. Amagi Inn! I always knew that was nefarious. I'm kidding. She had apparently been staying there alone. Perhaps she was taking a vacation to recover from her ordeal? Oh yes, the Amagi Inn. Their hot springs are first rate. The manager's teenage daughter also works there, and it's rumored that she'll take over the inn this spring. If that Why? happens, she'll be one of the youngest managers on record. I should book another trip there. Don't be uh, I see. Moving along, it's time for the weather report. The rain has begun to subside. From now until morning, heavy fog warnings will be in effect in the Inaba region. Visibility will be severely reduced, so please be careful if you plan on driving in the area. News continues. Just before the announcer was found dead, she was apparently staying at the Amagi Inn, run by Yukiko's family, which they already said, it seems the whereabouts of Saki Kanuchi, who discovered the body, are unknown. Is the ramen ready now? Has it been three Give minutes? Give it some more time. <laughs> Keep sneaking. Thanks. All right. Are you sick? You're probably still adjusting to the new environment. Nanako, could you get him some cold medicine? Why don't you do it, old man? You should get to bed after you take it. I guess I don't get dinner tonight. Okay, so it's on TV. Fifty minutes. And that's a good stopping point for the night. Yay! Oh, I can just delete my data. Ooh, that's convenient. Alrighty. Well, thank you for joining me. Until next time. Where's my mouse? Until next time. Katal, Katal.